Good afternoon, plumbers. As you know, we do everyday plumbing, the good, the bad, and the ugly, all while training my two sons to be plumbers. We all know it's gonna be a long journey, but well worth it because we know plumbing ain't going nowhere. But as you see, I'm riding solo. For today's plumbing adventure, we're swapping out some urinals, a continuation of the valve change, and we're going to attempt to put in used journals, talk the owner into getting new, and it was the best move ever. So stay tuned and we will see you inside and we're going to put in some American Standard urinals. Thank you for watching and if you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. We truly appreciate it. Follow this journey as I train my two sons, the plumbing trade. of the urinals they were going to try and replace with the existing urinals Bought them in a new one and now we're down to our last one our last urinal to do right out the gate we need two brackets 17 and three quarters center off of here 13 and a half apart for this particular urinal so let me mark this out, we'll get it done. Here's my 17 and 3 quarter center off the existing drain. So we're going to go center the drain. Thirteen and a half apart, which is 6 and 3 quarter center. Of our bracket, which gives us 13 and a half. Let's measure twice and cut once, baby. Six and three quarter. Six and three quarter. Oh. Thirteen and a half. Level over from our seventeen and a quarter center mark. There's our center. Seventeen seventeen and a quarter up of the bolt center of the drain. This was one of our problems on the old, that when they got it to place, they threw out all the brackets. Long story short, it doesn't pay to put it used. Center of this hole, some play. It's gonna be our start point. You gotta love when things go good. So far, so good. 17 and a quarter, let's check it. Off our pencil mark here. Very good. Because you know, 
works sometimes, yeah. It's not perfect when it hammer draw. Mm -hmm. okay. One. start. The first two went in like a dream. I figured I'd do two and then film one. And of course, already it's crooked out the gate. Now we're going to give it a dry run. The last two went in without a hitch. Ooh. Drop right in. Why don't you drop right in?
Five and three quarter. Ah, the phone. It's Christmas.
huh? Hey, He's at school. CB2? Oh, yeah. 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 College. Yeah. I got one in high school, one in. Yeah. Yeah, they're, they're both doing good. Same thing. One in college and one in high school. Oh, you do? Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's never ending, right? Yeah. It's expensive. Oh my god, I know. He'll be here tomorrow. Oh yeah? Yeah. Tomorrow and Friday. He's, he's part-time with school, you know? You don't mind my camera, do you? I have a YouTube channel. Yeah. yeah, man. It's all about teaching my kids plumbing. <laughs> they're not here today, though. <laughs> they're going to go back. They're going to go to school tonight when they get home. He's doing for what? For college. Oh, he's taking business. Business? Yeah. Businessman. He's going to be a businessman. Plumber. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. You know? Yeah. They can do it better than I did, you know? here today. We got a nice job for that boy. We got her done. Got the three urinals. We got the three urinals completed. I filmed the last one. Went pretty smooth, but not as smooth as the first two, which I was surprised. But in the end, we did get it done. Now I do have to caulk them. Everything's running perfect. No leaks, and we're gonna get CB2 caulking them things. He's got to learn how to caulk, and tomorrow, tomorrow could be caulk day. So with that, we thank you, and we will see you at the next one.